Hey, you all. I'm so okay. This is your girl J A S K C one. And today I am talking about um in holiday. You all remember a while ago I had said that I wanted to be the first one to come up with an annual in holiday. And this is just an update on the event and some more stuff that I need to pass on to you all. I have decided to have the event July 24th, 2010 at 2 p.m. At first I was going to make it for 5 p.m. But because I want um, all the activities that I have planned for um, you all, um, it's best if you get there at 2 p.m. Please. No riffraff. Um, <laughs> all models of Impalas are welcome. Um, I have decided that I was going to ask um, Sound Decisions. That's in um, that's on 138 in Clayton County. I'm going to I'm going to ask them to come out and specialize with the rims, the paint, and all that different things. They also have stereos and stuff. Um, cars and credit. They have said that they was going to come out and sell cars at the event. Well, sell Impalas at the event. And they have nice Impalas down there. That's where I got my car from, as you know. I still need my four people for my referral. Um, so I can get the one I have downstairs free. But if I find another one I like, which they have one now, I will also get that one. So many people can, many people can use me as their referral. But if you have to go, I know tax time is coming up. If you have to go there um, and get your car before then, I can understand. But please come out the car. Go check out Cars and Credit for a car. I'm also asking their sister store, which is Prime Auto and C&M Auto, to come out as well to the event on July 24th. Um, I don't know if Auto Finance can come out, but I'm also asking them to come out. And again, the fees range like this, um, $20 for the driver, and it's going to be $15 for the passenger. Now, this is the example because I know how people are. If you have two passengers, you pay $20, and one passenger will pay $15, and the other one will get in free. And the $20, where the money is actually just going to food, cost, um, once I find the venue, if we have to get someone to clean up um, to the to some other workers that's going to be there, so I'm going to have uh, that taken care of when you first get there. Um, and please, all vendors, um, for all the vendors that are coming, I ask that you arrive at least by 11:30 or 12 p.m. to set up because once everybody starts arriving, um, then I don't want a vendor running in. I want everybody to see what they need to see and then leave. Um, I don't care where you come from. Um, you can come up from Florida or whatever. But it is going to be in the Atlanta or where it's going to be in the Atlanta area. And as far as I mean by that, it may be by, by the Georgia Dome or in College Park or in Riverdale. So I haven't set a location as of yet exactly where I want it to be. I'm also asking when you come out that you bring um, either some baby clothes, uh, some bottles, powder milk, um, blankets, pampers, wipes, anything um, because I'm collecting. I have started collecting stuff for Haiti. And I'm focusing on the children, so if you can do anything for that, bring that out as well. And that will be collected once you get on the inside of the event. If you have anything now that you would like to contribute to Haiti, you can get at me on here. And I will, if you're in the Atlanta area, I will find a way to get with you and meet you so I can ship those items down there to Haiti. Um, let's see. I'm also looking for somebody that can put the words on the car and I really haven't um, found anybody but if you know someone that puts um, the uh, the word like Impala on the side of the car I'm also asking that they come out um, 
I know it's going to be a lot of my my color people there, but um, I am going to have um, more than pizza and wings. So I'm hoping that um, a lot of people come out. And I am expecting at least, I'm going for a hundred people. So, I'm not sure exactly how that will go. So, that's basically it. Um, I haven't, as far as modeling, I haven't really been doing any modeling. I've been applying for stuff, but... Kind of got, kind of got an idea. Someone was like, "You'll be an old model," because I'm, I'm about to be 28 this year. So that's like, "You'll be an old model." And I guess people have a perception that models are like 20, 19, or whatever. But, um, so I haven't really been focused on my modeling career. I've been focusing more on, um, on acting and stuff. I'm also, um. I'm not applying for anything acting. I kind of need some help. I kind of need an agent. So I may go around looking for me um, an agent or something. I still do want to work with Tyler Perry. Um, as you know, he's on tour right now in California, I believe. So maybe once he gets back, I'm going to um, try to see if I can apply for some work with him. Um, i still been off. I've been off work now a month. So, I don't know when I'm going back to work. So, I need to make other options. And I want to go ahead and be happy with my career. And that is my main career choice right now. It's modeling and acting. Um, there are also going to be models there washing your cars. Um, I'm looking. I'm going to start soon. So, I'm looking. I'm casting men. And... So just to be point blank, I am looking for men like Tyrese. That's my husband. Don't y'all mess with him. Um, someone that's not afraid to take off their shirt. And when they take off their shirt, they're able to please. They're also going to be washing cars. Um, and it might turn into a paid event. I just don't know. It may not. But I am holding casting for men. No race, no particular color. You can look like Jason on General Hospital. Long as you find. So, and it's going to be a panel of women critiquing you. So, I need you to be comfortable. Um, and we'll get back into more of that later. But I wanted to pass it on to you all. Um, and that's just pretty much it for today. I'll talk to you all soon. Bye.